Okay. Okay. Let's go. Whoa. Over. Back in business. Sushi sandwich for Susan. Sushi sandwich for Susan. Susan's sushi sandwich. Sandwich Susan. Excellent. Hello, hi, welcome back to The Humble Bartender. I'm Will Crawshaw. Today we're gonna to be talking you through a fantastic cocktail, a favorite of mine. We're using beer in this one, gin, lemon, ginger. It's gonna be excellent. So the cocktail I'm gonna be showing you how to make today is Shaky Pete's Ginger Brew. Fantastic drink. Created by a chap called Pete Dreary in 2008. This is for a beef eater cocktail competition where you had to highlight London ingredients as far as I'm aware. So he's combined, obviously, London gin, beef eater, with a London ale. So Pete claims his inspiration came from a visit to a former brew house called Hayes Wharf, which was also a depository for exotic ingredients such as ginger and lemon. So he's put all these ingredients together and turned out to be one of the most refreshing drinks I've ever had. Really, really good. This drink has actually been dubbed more of a drink for men, which um, I don't believe in. I think it's a drink that can be enjoyed by absolutely anybody. So we're gonna dive straight in. I'm gonna get my blender out for this one, which is a bit unusual, but it works a treat. It's probably the best way to do this cocktail. This is how Pete did his in the cocktail competition. Competition. Right, so for this drink, you're gonna need London dry gin, you're gonna need a fantastic ale, you can use a London ale if you wanna stay true to the homage of this cocktail. So today I'm using Life and Death, so this is Vocation Brewery in Hebden Bridge actually, so it's relatively local to me up in Yorkshire. Fantastic stuff. You've got elements of fruit salad, tropical fruits with a rich golden uh, color in there as well. It's really delicious. I first tried this on draft. Ales for the top to actually make the base of this cocktail. You can use a relatively tall glass for this. Just gonna give this a quick polish up. Um, you can use a nice beer glass for this with a handle, like a little, little stein or something smaller. This is a good size for me. See, I don't have one with a handle on. I really would like one with a handle on with a beer glass. All I've got is a pint glass like that, but that's just a bit too big for this cocktail. So we're gonna use this. Uh, it should work absolutely fine, I don't mind. So we've got the beer, we've got a glass, and we're gonna get the blender out. This has just had a little rinse, so excuse the moisture in there. It is clean. So we're just gonna fix this on and get our ingredients in. So first and foremost, we're gonna use a London gin. So I'm using Tanqueray today. Um, fantastic gin, brilliant London dry. I love it, fantastic quality, brilliant flavor, nice and strong, happy days. 35 mils goes in, so we're gonna measure this up and straight into the blender. So I've juiced some lemon here. We're gonna have 50 mils into the blender to balance it all out. Works quite well with beer and the ginger syrup. I did have a video of me making this. It went a bit tits up, I'll be honest. So to make this, all I've taken is just a thumb piece of ginger and blended it with sugar syrup. So sugar syrup being two to one. So a nice thick sugar syrup, but just blended it through, strained out all the little bits and bottled it up. Like you can still see it's a little bit grainy in there, but it's got some fantastic flavor. Um, you can make it other ways. So you can just steep the ginger in the syrup or the best way to make it is to actually juice the ginger and then make the syrup using the ginger juice. So one part's ginger juice to one part sugar. Works amazing. So for these purposes today, so we're gonna use another 50 mils of the syrup. This may sound like quite a lot, but you really wanna taste the ginger. Obviously it's getting lengthened with the beer. There's a lot of lemon juice in there as well to balance it. So that's looking good. So they're your ingredients for the base of this cocktail. So all we need to do now is blend this with a little bit of ice. Crushed ice works best, but I don't have crushed ice at home. So we're gonna use about half a cup of ice. So I'm gonna call that a cup for today. Get some ice in. That should be fine. Let's crack this on. We're just gonna blitz this up and top it with a beer. Simple as that. So get this crack in. It's all the work out of making a cocktail, doesn't it, really? Right, so there's a few chunks of ice left in there. I'm not too worried. You smell that ginger. Whoa. Oh yeah, that's fantastic. Really spicy ginger. They've got the gin in the back. It's like a little smoothie. So in the glass. So this works quite well. So you've got a good gap for your beer there. If anything, you could probably leave a little bit more. Once the beer goes in, it completely transforms it. So we're gonna add just a touch. 
we say about 100 mils. So I'm gonna fill this near enough to the top. Give this a bit of a stir up. Absolutely delicious. Ah, oh, that is good. Shaky pizza, everybody. Nice and simple. Gin, lemon, ginger, and a beautiful IPA. You just use a London Ale. Whatever beer takes your fancy, really. It's quite versatile. The flavor profile works quite well with most beers. I just like this one because it's kind of got a bit of a tropical vibe to it. It's nice and strong, too. So let's have a little taste. Oh. No real garnish needed for this one, just nice and simple. You can put a little stick of ginger in there or a lemon wedge if you like, um, but I don't feel the need for one really. Amazing drink, really tasty. Mm. Delicious beer. Ah. Ginger lemon, super simple. Right guys, so that's the Shaky Beats. If you've enjoyed it, please do comment. Please let me know what you think. If you've twisted it up yourself, using different gins, different fruit, different types of beers, see how it works, please do let me know. So as always, please do like, share and subscribe if you've enjoyed this video, I do appreciate it. Get onto the website at www.thehumblebartender.com or follow me on Instagram as well at thehumblebartender or get us on Twitter at humblebartender. So this is Shaky Beats, guys, and we'll cross up. I'll see you soon. Banger. Delivery man's here. This is just shaky. Two seconds, mate. Thanks, buddy. Yeah. One sec.